Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about a dual PC streaming keyboard and mouse setup. So in a general sense, we're talking about keyboard and mice and keyboard and mice. So without further ado, let's get into it, shall we? Before we get into this, I want to say you can also apply this not just to your dual streaming PC setup, but you can also apply it to your gaming and your work laptop setup. So basically, if you've got two separate systems, it's how we can easily minimize the clutter on the desktop and have it completely wire free and being able to switch between both of them very, very easily. So the first keyboard we're going to be talking about is going to be the Logitech Craft Keyboard. Now, the functions I'm about to mention can also be applied to the MX Key series and the Logitech K780 series. Because of the Logitech Craft high price tag, you can easily take it a step down and you don't need the full keyboard or need the fancy little function wheel that they've got on the top left corner. So what makes this keyboard so special is the fact is that you can actually, if you've got more than one Logitech dongle or Bluetooth on either of your systems, you can actually set up multiple PCs up to maximum of three across this keyboard and you can switch to it with a click of a button. Now, this is very, very handy as I didn't want to have a gaming keyboard as a day to day driver for having to type on, for having to write emails, to having to sit there and actually like browse the internet with. It's sometimes it can get a little bit loud. Sometimes it might get a little bit uncomfortable, but that's completely fine. With the Logitech Craft or the MX Key series, it's such a joy to type on. You're literally just, it, it's such an easy keeper to type on and in comparison to the clutter and the clankety clank that you get from kit mechanical keyboards, if you don't like it, you're, you're, you're gonna be set. <laughs> now what I actually pair this with is an actual other mouse called the Logitech MX Master. Now I'm only using the first generation, so I can't speak of the second or the third generation, but this is a very, very comfortable ergonomic mouse. And also paired with the Delta Hub Carpio 2.0 for the wrist rest. If you've not seen the video, click on the link up here. Nice segue, Colin. It's, it's so, so freaking comfortable. And you've got a couple of buttons on the side. You've got a side scroller as well on top of the top scroll. You can actually engage it whether or not it's a free scroll or if you're kind of like met with a bit of resistance on it as well. It's, it's just so comfortable. These two paired together are like the ultimate dream day-to-day -day drivers for your gaming or work setup. Speaking of gaming, let's get into the next keyboard. So instead of a full width keyboard or a TKL keyboard, I've gone with a one-handed keyboard. Now this is the Red Dragon K585, which is a full wireless one-handed keyboard. Now this comes with five separate macro keys that you can actually have four different presets for. Now, these macros are very, very easy to reach. You can reach the left-hand side with pretty much your pinky finger or the finger next to it. And on top of that as well, on the right-hand side, you can reach it with your thumb, which is literally just right above the space bar, which is so comfortable to use. The keyboard comes with a wrist rest as well, which is very handy. And on top of that, the whole thing is wireless and the charge I have found has lasted for freaking days. And it's so good, so good for long gaming sessions and everything as well. So I pair this with the Razer Basilisk and the reason for being that it's a very, very comfortable ergonomic mouse to get to use. The weight of it I find is optimal for gaming for myself. And um, you can also um, increase and decrease the DPI and has also got what I call the trigger button, which basically you can customize exactly what you do with it for me. I decrease the DPI to extremely low if I'm sniping in Warzone or Fortnite or something like that. And it's just so, so handy to have. Now, the great thing about this is the fact that, like I said, with a click of a button, you can actually switch between using your gaming or your PC setup or use your gaming or your work setup. In a general sense, you need one dongle for each or Bluetooth on each device. And all you do is just predefine exactly what button it is on the keyboard. If it's one, two or three, which one it is. So for example, when I'm in the middle of doing stuff on stream, if I need to quickly do something on the streaming computer from the gaming computer, I literally just press one and boom, that's my streaming PC. If I wanna go back to the gaming PC, I literally press two. And because of this, it's so easy to switch from one to the other. And needless to say, you get a lot more room for your mouse to flow around in Warzone or Valorant or Fortnite or whatever game you are playing. It's just such a joy to have and it's just such a clean looking setup. And with the whole thing being wireless, there's no need for cable clutter anymore and I just love it. So I thought I'd just share this with you guys of exactly how I set up both my computers. It's just, it's just so good. But that's about it now guys. I will be doing a full studio tour very, very shortly. Um, however, things are gonna be changing around here soon. Well, not even here, possibly elsewhere. Thanks very much for watching the video guys. If you like it, like it below. If you wanna to subscribe to the channel, subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you in the next one. I'll see you then.